my name is Maddie. I'm a senior at Liberty High School. This is my second year in the fire science program. I think this class is unique because you learn a lot of life skills that you might not be able to in other classes. It's a fun break from school to come to the station and not be at school for seven hours every day. Um, this class has helped me get my job that I have right now as a lifeguard because we got certified first responders and uh, we got our CPR card. Uh, so my name is Miguel Ayala. I am um, I'm a senior at Glencoe High School. Yeah, this class has really helped me. Um, it's made me a better person in general. Like, uh, taught me that hard work pays off. Um, this this uh, this is something that I've, I I want to do after high school. So this right here is a little step, a little baby steps that I'm taking to uh, get known, you know, by fire chiefs and also people like the firemen that are already in. And so, yeah, this is a great, great program. I recommend it to a lot of people. I plan to attend uh, Chemeketa. They have a really good fire science program. Hey, I'm Joseph Roy, and I go to Liberty High School. And this program, fire science, it's you know, it's a pretty good program. I like it, and the reason I got into it, because you know, I've I've always wanted to become a firefighter or a medic, and I figured this would probably be the best option for me to do. And last year I took Fire Science 1 and you know I really liked that so I thought why not do this one and so you know I did and I really like it and after high school you know one of the things I really want to do is go into the military to become either a firefighter or a medic I mean I know it's gonna be hard but hard work hard work is good I'm running lens on the coordinator and one of the instructors for the fire science program here at Liberty High School in Hillsboro. Um, fire science program started about 14 years ago at the Capitol Center um, on 185th and four years ago moved over to Liberty High School. Um, the program's uh, made up of all uh, students of all the high schools in Hillsboro, Glencoe, Century, Hill High, and Liberty. We provide a, a look and experience into the fire service and the EMS service which the students um, can gain that further knowledge kind of experience. Uh, post high school, uh, we work with them to bridge the gap between high school and college as far as resume building, interviewing techniques, and just life skills and hopefully provide some direction for the students who may not know exactly what they're doing post high school and just um, opening up uh, those ideas and those direction paths to gain them a more successful path once they uh, graduate from high school. My name is Corey Johnson. I'm an instructor here with the Fire Protection Technology course uh, through the school district. Uh, I've been instructing here for five or six years. Um, we do an overall uh, view of what the fire service is and all the different components that make up the fire service. Uh, through the class itself, we'll cover fire, the fire service, its history, uh, where it's going. We'll cover EMS because that's a lot of what we do now. And then we'll also cover the wildland portion. Um, so there are a lot of things we cover in here as far as showing people a pathway to different careers. Uh, hi, my name is Lucas Dyke and I first started in this program when I realized I wanted to be a firefighter like my father. He's been volunteering since he was a teenager and has been a firefighter for over 30 years as a captain. And I thought, wow, that seems like a great job and a great sense of family. I should probably get into that. And so he recommended this class. Uh, he had me sit down and talk with the lieutenant here and he explained to me what the class was about. And I thought it was a great chance for me to get college credit and, you know, meet some new people. It is a very intensive class. They do make you do a lot of physical work and they will push you. But if you're willing to do that and you want, really want to get a job in the fire service, I definitely recommend it. So I'm going to be going to PCC for an associate's degree in fire science and then move on to hopefully become a firefighter. Um, I'm Austin Lawrence. I'm 19 years old. I just graduated from Glencoe High School in 2014. And I'm currently an intern firefighter for uh, Washington County Fire District 2 in North Plains. My last two years, I took a program called the Liberty Fire Science Program. This was a junior and senior year program. This was a program where I was introduced to the basic skills of firefighting as well as EMS skills. Uh, this class really sparked my interest in the fire service as a career for me and my future. Prior to taking this class, I didn't know what I wanted to do in my future. I went on a ride along with the Hillsborough Fire Department and it immediately sparked my interest and I, I fell in love with the job and became very passionate about the career. Uh, through this class, you know, I get to uh, not only see the people in, the, in their junior years of high school, but their senior years and beyond. And it 
really allows a lot of the kids to open up, become more confident, uh, really embrace what it means to, uh, to be a leader and a part of the community. So um, it's really rewarding.